Hey guys, welcome to Red 5 -0. Thank you for tuning into another video. If you're new to the channel, thank you for stopping by. Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future videos. So in today's video, we are going to be looking at how to fold the rear seats or the back seats of your Mustang. This works for the S550 Mustang, so from 2015 and up. And I bet the process is pretty similar for your S197 Mustang, which were before 2015, from 2005 to 2014. Now obviously Mustang is a two-door coupe with four-seater configuration, so as you can imagine the back seats aren't all that, but I actually did a video on that where I did try to uh, sit in the back seat and see how much room I would really have. Surprisingly it wasn't too bad, obviously I wouldn't do it for the long trips or anything like that, but for short trips it wasn't all that bad. So if you guys are interested you can definitely check the link out in the description or click the card above. Now for today's purpose for the video is obviously the how to fold the back, back seat and why you want to fold the back seats well it will allow you for a lot more storage now mustang's trunk is actually really good but it doesn't hurt if you can fold the back seat and allow for even more storage for your summer projects or if you're moving or anything like that you can do that in a mustang so it's very simple to fold the back seats let's go ahead and try to try to do that all right so to do that obviously get the front door unlocked you're gonna see these these levers, so you're gonna go ahead and pull on this so you can access the back seat. And there we've got the very spacious back seat, as you can see, uh, but not really. All right, so once you're in the back here, you're gonna wanna locate these tabs, which are in each corner of the seat. So as you can see right here, we've got one on the left corner, and for the right, we have right here. So we've got these two tabs in each corner of the seats so we're gonna wanna pull on these tabs so I'm gonna see how the best way to do that with the camera in one hand let's go okay so now that we're back here I'm gonna go ahead and pull on this tab there we go and now we're gonna go on the other side pull that one out let's see so you can see it right there I'm gonna pull this in the front first And you can see, pull this out, and there's our trunk through space where you can kind of see how much it can really fit. So let me show you from the trunk over there. All right, so we've got the trunk open and the seats folded. Here you go. You can see it gives you a lot more space, to be honest. I mean, you can easily fit, I want to say like five to six feet in length right there. And it's got pretty good wide opening. Sometimes the seat opening in some of the cars aren't that much, but this one pretty much covers the entire back seat. So that's really good. It's got a huge opening, and this can work for your summer project. No longer you're gonna have to drive your boring sedan or SUV to go to Home Depot and carry some of your summer projects. The Mustang can get the job done, guys. Now to fold them back, obviously you're gonna take these, put them back up, and rest it against there, but make sure you hear the click sound. So, there we go. So this way, now it's not moving. So if you break hard or something, you don't want the seats to kind of come back. And if you've got stuff in the trunk, that falls all over your cabin. So we'll try it for the other one. All right, so we're gonna grab this right here. Shove it in the back first. It's hard to do it with one hand. All right, there we go. And now it's not shaking, so that means it's properly done. All right, that should be it. Now, as you guys saw from those clips, it's very e easy to fold the back seats of the 2019 Mustang GT in my case. And it's very useful to allow for a lot more back storage than you would imagine out of a two-door two coupe, or four-seater two-door coupe. So definitely, if you have a lot of storage or you're moving or something, definitely utilize that feature. In my opinion, it's, it's well worth it. It gives you a lot more storage than you would expect out of a Mustang. So there it is, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe to Red 5.0 for future videos.